Hey everyone! Welcome back to the ZZ Plays LP of Super Mario 63. In the last part, we went in here, the Bob the Babom Battlefield, and um, got two more shine sprites. One was a secret one, and the other one was for defeating King Babom. So let's go back in, guys, and see what we have in store next. Alright, Island in the Sky. There's an island in the sky, journey upwards, past turbulent winds, past flying Koopas, past even a butterfly! Woo! Scary, guys. To reach the floating island in the sky. Let's go! So, we have Pandora? No, I'm just kidding. Kind of a cheap joke. Woo! I, it took me a couple tries, but I realized that, um, what you, uh, how, how you launch out of those, you press C. Can you ground pound these? Well, maybe if I got solid contact, I can maybe find out. Nope, doesn't look like it. Alright. Onward. What does the map say? Uh, in. A map is here. Um, insert. Insert, um, Zelda CDI reference here. Um, <laughs> oh wait, no, that's not even the map. What am I talking about? Um, well I guess we're just not going to see the map. It's, but I know where we're supposed to go, I actually already ran through this a lot. I recorded it again because I failed really, really hard. That's basically all you need to know. Um, Alright, just scoot along here. And... Okay. So far, so good. Oh! And of course, as soon as you say that, you... A bomb explodes in my face, so... That's not healthy in any way. It's not part of your, uh... It's not part of... a. Uh, of a healthy recommended diet is a bomb to the face, so let's try to avoid that from here on out. Alright, and you're gonna see like the rest of this is just gonna be um you know get trying to get up along the clouds. Um Yeah, I think it's cool how um the creator made big enough maps to uh or big enough stages so it's not like get from left to right. It's actually you are given a um you're given a uh set goal, and depending on the set goal, you go to different places on the map, and it's really cool, because the maps are pretty huge. Pretty huge for a Flash game, at the very least. I think that's probably why I like this game so much. It's just huge. The scale of it is just massive. So, um, yeah, it's really cool. Oh, this is cool, guys. All right. Wing cap, triple jump or dive, and then fly through the sky. Um, I remember f this is why I kind of had to quit last time actually because I couldn't figure figure this out. But there we go, flying, oh. and failing. Flying and falling uh, sound similar, I think. Oh, am I supposed to push up? Okay, apparently you're supposed to push up or down, I think. Yep. Yeah, you push up, kind of swoop along here. This is the only way that you're supposed to get to the island? I don't know, I'm not seeing much of anything. That could prove to be a problem. Ooh, that's cool. This is actually pretty fun. It's almost as fun as it was in the original game. Until you fall. Falling is uh, just as unfortunate as it is in the original game. Especially when you do that. Well, um, I guess now you, you guys got an idea of what the wing cap does in this game. You can just fly around, but let's actually try, you know, getting the objective now. So I'm going to cut ahead to um, back up where the wing cap was, and um, we'll, con we'll continue from there. Alright, we're back up here, and my guess is that we have to, um, take this cannon. 
I'll just get the wing star too for kicks. Alright, zoom out. And fire. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Um, this is another go. And, uh, try not to run into any shy guys. Oh, there we go. There it is, guys. Kind of figured. Unless I fail and don't get it. There we are. Nice. Here we go! I think that's probably more my range rather than the high squeaky thing where my voice cracked the last time. That wasn't very good. So, Island in the Sky, our fourth Shine Sprite. Alright, we probably need to pick up the pace though, so going back in. The five silver stars. Sometimes a Shine Sprite can break down into five silver stars and get scattered throughout the land. You'll have to collect all five fragments to recover it. I'm pretty sure those are just this. I'm pretty sure those are just the stars, man, from Super Galaxy. Also, something I, I didn't I didn't mention last time, but you can start out if you found the nozzle throughout the level. You can start out with a specific nozzle, and because uh, the um, hover nozzle has been a lifesaver for me so far, I'm gonna start off with that. So let's go look for five silver stars. Um, I don't believe that those are the same as... No, they're not the same as the, uh, wing cap star that we found. Even though that does look sil silvery and metallic, it's not the same. Alright. Oh, goodness. You see, I, I tried pressing up, and it doesn't really do much of anything. It uh, kind of works when it decides to, but I think you've heard enough of me talk about that, so I'm going to leave it alone. Um, I wonder what the silver stars are, though. Where am I supposed to go for that? Oh, well, that's probably a pretty big indicator. Um, Yeah, I guess the little silver star mechanic, as well as the sling star right here, that's also implemented from... Uh, from Super Mario Galaxy. I think that was originally just a, like kind of a variation on the uh, red coin or the eight find the eight red coins thing. And so I love how there's so many arrows pointing to this thing. It's like go here, go here, go here. No, I don't think so. I'm gonna go away. I don't care about you guys. Uh, okay, I'm just kidding. I love you. I love you, Sling Star. I wouldn't leave you. All right, here we go. And there's the first one. I love how the, um, this, I guess this level is going to probably re resemble Super Mario Galaxy quite a bit, except for the fact that I have a flood on my back. So, anything over here? Maybe? Yes, there is. And you are not going to take that silver star from me, the bomb. I'm just going to smack you with my ground pound. And, um, take these up to here. You see, that's so much easier than just, um, trying to hop on the tiny little things. Take the sling star up here, the tiny little wood, wood blocks, and I can just cheat. I'm trying to spin, I think, preemptively. There we go. There's one, and, oh, okay. There's the last one. I kind of thought I'd see them all. Maybe you can tell me. Okay, the silver star has one left. I know! I can do basic math. Unless maybe you didn't see it from the beginning. I guess he's just trying to be helpful. I guess I shouldn't criticize him for that. Um, and that's what you get for getting criticized. You nearly die or nearly fall off. I think I've confused death for uh, <laughs> just simple falls before when I actually have died in this game. So shouldn't tend to feet in that way. Where's the last... Silver Star. I can see myself taking quite a bit more time than I'd like. Um, you know what? I'm actually gonna cut ahead to when I find it. Uh, all right. So, um, especially now. All right. See you around. All right, guys. I used the zoom out thing and I found it. So let's see if we can try this in one attempt. All right. And so far, so good. Yes. And now I have to go back there. 
and I will do that. So let's try not to die from now until then. Although that shouldn't be too hard. And booyah! Here we go! The five silver stars. Okay. Save up. Another room has opened in the castle. Yeah, we'll take care of the other ones once we're finished with this right here. And the last one is going to be collect the eight red coins, but we're going to have to save that for next time. Okay. Um, this has been part four of um, ZZ Plays LP of Super Mario 63. And I'll see all you guys around.